Hi, I'm Katherine Timp with Campus Reform, and I'm here with Grover Norquist. Thank you so much for joining us. Good to be with you. Just wanted to ask you, young people showed a lot of enthusiasm for Chris Christie in the elections mm -hmm. last night. What do you think of him? Well, Chris Christie is obviously one of the people, one of maybe six or seven, who could run as a successful governor for the Republican mm -hmm. nomination. He's governed well in a difficult state, Democrat House, Democrat Senate, and yet he got 130 billion dollars in reduction in unfunded liabilities. Mm -hmm. uh, and he took on the teachers union while everybody understood that he was fighting the unions, he wasn't anti-education. Mm -hmm. So he taught a lot of Republican governors how to speak about reforming education, recognizing the teachers unions are often in the way without allowing the teachers unions to say, oh, you're anti-teacher. No, 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 he's fighting what the unions. What about union. some of his policies? You think, is he too big government for you? Or would you like to see him run in 2016? Well, the, the, First of all, I think he will run in 2016, yeah. so I don't get a vote yeah. uh, on that. Uh, and I think he's a fine voice uh, for the Northeast uh, Republicans. Uh, he, when you talk about how he governs in Wisconsin, Scott Walker has also governed quite well, as did uh, Louisiana's governor, Bobby Jindal. They have Republican houses and Senate. So to a little bit, you have to grade on a curve uh, as we did with George W. Bush, who had a Democratic Senate and didn't have much in the way of accomplishments as uh, governor of Texas because the Democrats could stop anything he wanted to do. And as we had with governor of Massachusetts, Romney, who had an 80 percent House and an 80 percent right. Senate against him, they could override his veto anytime they wanted to. So that said, given his situation and the state, he has moved mountains and I think will be a strong voice for conservative governance. Thank you very much for being here. Catherine Timms, Campus Reform.